Hey everyone, welcome back to JavaScript tutorial. In this tutorial, we will understand how to add and remove array element from the array. So we will understand how to add and remove array element at the beginning or end. The beginning refers to the first element in the array which is 0 and the end refers to the last array index which you can get using length minus 1 method. So in this tutorial, we will understand four methods that helps you to add and remove array element from the array. These methods are pop, push, shift, and unshift. Push and pop add and remove respectively elements to the end of the array. Likewise, unshift and shift add and remove respectively elements to the beginning of the array. Now let's understand how these methods work. Suppose you have an array of numbers, so I will say constant arr is equal to and in the square bracket I will specify array element. So I will say 2, comma 3, comma 4. Now you know that you have three elements in this array. On zero index you have two on first index you have 3 and on second index you have 4 value. In the previous video we learned how to figure out array index. Now in this tutorial I will show you another way to find out array index. So just say console.log and specify your array here. Now on the console you can see your array elements. Just click on this little icon. When you click on this icon, you will get your array element with its index. So now here, you can see on 0 index, you have 2. On first index, you have 3. And on second index, you have 4. Right? Now, if you wanted to add any element at the end of the array, then you can do this using push method. The push method will return the length of the array after inserting the array element. For example, so I will say console.log and just specify my array dot push method. I will just call push method here and in the parenthesis I will specify my element which we wanted to insert in the array. And after that I will just print my array on the console. So when you execute this, you will get array length and array. Now you can see 5 is added in the array element at the end. You are free to push any type of element in the array. If you wanted to push string A, then you can push that also, like this. So I will just remove this 5 and here I will specify A, right? Now. If you wanted to remove the last element to the array, then you can do that with pop method just like this. I will just copy these two statements and here I will just paste it and I will remove the push method and call pop method here. Now when you execute this statement, it will first print a remove element on the console and then print the array. You don't need to specify last element in the parenthesis of pop method. It will automatically remove the last array element to the array. Right? Now, let's understand how shift and unshift method work. Now, shift and unshift method do the same job like push and pop method, but from the beginning. It means unshift and shift method will add and remove array element respectively to the beginning of the array just like this. So I will just specify console.log and call the array dot unshift method and in the parenthesis I will just specify my array element which we wanted to push at the beginning right and just print the array here. So the unshift method will add array element at the beginning so you can see 1 is added at the beginning of the array. Likewise, shift method will remove the array element to the beginning. 
like this. So I will just copy these two statements and print here and just remove my unshift method and just specify shift method here right now you can see your first array element will be removed right that's it i hope you understand this lecture i have asked a question in the comment answering that question will help you to understand this topic more easily that is all for now we will see you in the next tutorial